that was a clip from Peter Rabbit 2, The Runaway, which is in theatres right now. Um, congratulations on the film. It is an absolute masterpiece. Congratulations it's, to you. That's not my words. All anybody's saying is, it's the greatest, as I say, it's the greatest kids' movie of all time. And <laughs> I, I have to say, it was such a pleasure. I always enjoy doing this film, even though, like, you know, Margot, you and I are in isolation and yeah. Rose is really out there doing all the, all the heavy lifting with Dono. I mean, Rose, your sons are five and three. Have they seen the film yet? Are they excited that their mum is in this, you know, big kids' movie? They, they get a little bit overwhelmed. They're, like, not quite ready to see me in the TV yet. They're a bit like, hmm, yeah, no, Mama, let's watch something else. They, they, but <laughs> I... I took my five-year-old to kindergarten the other day and I got surrounded by the kids. I've never... It was the sweetest thing that... Because it's... You know, both films have been such big hits in Australia and all the little, like, five- and six-year-olds and then the bigger kids, like, 10-year-olds and 11-year-olds just going, do you play in Peter Rabbit? Do you play in Peter Rabbit? And I was like... So adorable. It was just heartbreaking. And eventually the teachers got a little bit angry. They were like, right, girls, let's go, let's go, girls, let's go. <laughs> they were like... They were over it. But I was so... I couldn't have been more, like, you know, charmed. It was really That's so, so, so sweet. sweet. Now, Margot, you are... And I don't think people ever realise... Like, what you are doing in this film, I think your voicing of Flopsy, I think, really grounds the entire thing. I think it's absolutely brilliant. Were you a fan of the, of the Peter Rabbit books when you were growing up? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I watched it after school. But, um, yes, I had, like, the little bowls and, like, the cups and the book, everything. I'm guessing it was like that in London and maybe America too. No, it was, in Australia, yeah. Australia, for sure. They were read to me and I've read yeah. them to the yeah. kids. And, I, I mean, it. you've got a special affini affiliation with, uh, with bunnies. <laughs> you sleep with this every night. <laughs> I know. Has this got any connection to Peter Rabbit please, in any way? Please, no one psychoanalyse the fact that I'm 30 and I sleep with a bunny rabbit every night. And also, I know what you're all thinking, that doesn't look like a bunny rabbit at all and it is but she's 30 years old and she's looking a little worse for wear because she, you know I actually only let my mum stitch her up and wash her and because of COVID I haven't seen my mum in like almost two years now so she's she's yeah looking a bit raggedy but that you is only rabbit. let your mum tend yeah. to her <laughs> that is so Margo. adorable Margo what happened I know <laughs> this is a safe space Rose, when you were growing up, you actually had pet rabbits, right? Were, were they mischievous but charming and would constantly get into scrapes? Uh, <laughs> and wearing little jackets and yeah. stuff like that. Yeah, uh, I did. I had, I had one pet rabbit and she, she, she was a little bit mischievous. She eventually ran away and hid under the neighbour's house for, like, I mean, like, a good ten years, I think. She was there for a long time. Did she die? And yeah, became I... a little bit of a recluse, but, um... I think your bunny uh, might have died, Rose. I think died. that's what... <laughs> I don't hey, want to be the one to hey, break hey, it to you, no, but... I think enough. Now's not the time. Enough. When your mum and dad said she's living enough. under the neighbour's house <laughs> for a decade, I... Uh, uh, I'm amazed you haven't worked this out yourself. Your, your, your bunny died, and then after ten years, they... They bought you back one that looked vaguely similar? I won't, I won't have you talk like that. I won't have the, the, she's still there. The rabbit is still there. What a lovely note to... <laughs> God. I know. <laughs> Peter Rabbit, <laughs> and don't kill your pet. Peter Rabbit 2 is in theatres right now, everybody. We'll be right back. <laughs>